Hello everyone, today I'm going to be reviewing the Frisian horse. So the Frisian horse I believe was one of the first buyable horses in the game. They are pricey on the 990 star points price but I'll go over to Steve's in a bit and go and see them there. So I have two Frisians, they are my favourite breed. So yes, I spent quite a lot on buying them but they are my favourite breed in real life. Um, in the game, um, eh, I, I like a lot of horses in the game, so I can't really say that they're my favourite. They are obviously taller than the Fjords, they are the same height as the Frisian Sport Horses in Andes, and taller than the American Quarter Horse. They do have some feathering, which honestly it looks slightly strange, and most of the time I wear polos so you can't see it anyways. But the feathering on these horses on the game is slightly strange. I mean, it would be a bit hard to add feathering since these were, you know, one of the first buyable horses and you can't really compare them to the new quarter horses or anything because they have learnt a lot in the past year or however long it's been since these horses have come out to be able to animate them how the quarter horses are. So this is him with tack on, as you can see the polos cover his feathering. He's huge, um, the big horses are huge, which I love, I've always loved the bigger breeds of horses, but I also do love the little American Quarter Horses, which are unusually small. So these wonderful horses are sold at Steve's Farm and they come in three colours, um, you know, the colours aren't there's obviously a difference but it's not a huge one. So this is the more silvery Frisian horse. There's not really much to it, just got more silver highlights. They have three strength, two discipline and two agility which is actually the same as the Morgan horses which is surprising. Um, they do cost 990 star coins and are restricted to only level 12 players. Now this is one of the hardest horses to get because they are restricted to level 12 players. They are 990 star coins. I got star coins for um, those gift cards that you could get so I bought like two of these guys. I love them personally because they are obviously my favourite breed. The next Frisian is just this kind of black one. Um, you know, he's just black, he doesn't really have any particular highlights, he's just kind of a normal Frisian, I guess. I have this one and the other one. The next one is this navy one, which is the one I have. Again, they're all the same price, there's nothing too different about them except for their colour. I just want to say that there is this Frisian sport horse, which is, this is a horse that I have. I have all of the Frisian sport horses and all of the Andes except for the buckskin one. But this is probably like a cheaper alternative if you don't really want to get a Frisian. Also, this one is adorable. Um, the Frisian sport horse, and we had 109 Southwinds and restricted to only level 8. Now, I've raced these guys and obviously he's gotten me, you know, a few ribbons before the quarter horses came in or before... I was racing Arabians or Fjords or anything, but he has gotten me a couple of ribbons and I think that if you like horses like this, then go ahead and buy one. It's also nice because not a lot of people buy them, I mean, not anymore. People always used to have them, but people don't really buy them as often as they did because new horses have come out that are cheaper and faster. I'll just do a quick demonstration of the gates because there's nothing really interested about their gates or um, really anything special. You know, they're kind of the generic big horse gates that you get on Star Sable. I love their canter and their trot. Um, I haven't really ridden a big horse like this for quite a while. Night Flame, who is my black and white uh, Frisian Sport Horse is my favourite big horse because I just love him. And there's like this slow gallop which I love. I don't know why but I love this. And then if we can find somewhere to just run along. Run along here. 
for a bit and then just the gallop the stop rearing going back as as I said before nothing too interesting I'll take him over a jump oh, I'm surprised I didn't fail that with the Frisians, there isn't any ability to change their hairstyle because they considered a unique hairstyle, which isn't really true considering considering that the Andes have the same hairstyle except for the feathering. If you want a horse that you can change the hairstyle on, you can always get the black Frisian sport horse. So that is my review on the Frisian horses. Overall, I think they're really nice horses. No, they're not really considered champ horses anymore due to the new quarter horses. But I still love them. I still think they're beautiful. They're great to just ride around in if you want to just do quests and stuff. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this review. I'm sorry it's me rambling on again. I'm going to try to make them as short as possible. But I hope you all had a good day and goodbye.